maar. Als het goed is zijn we nu live. Ja, we zijn live. We are alive. We are alive. Are we alive? We are alive. Dan moet ik even TeamViewer erbij pakken. And we'll do it in English. Yes, definitely. It's almost 11. Well, 1, 2, 11. Yeah. The only thing I need now is the power adapter, otherwise the laptop will... Uh, well, then you go get your power go, adapter. Go down. Uh, this is okay. And I'll start off. Yeah, you'll start off. I'll open this one. Okay, welcome everybody on this Corona live streaming session. No, no Corona jokes. <laughs> well, we're testing Corona tracks. Okay. Uh, we hope you're all healthy and safe. Uh, we are, we are on safe distance. And yeah. uh, uh, well, uh, we're, for us it's kind of a dream come true because uh, we have been uh, longing to review and test this WISE 501 deck for uh, maybe about one or two years. When I think two years, yeah. And we yeah. met Daniel at high end and he said, well, as modest as he is, too modest, well, um, maybe we have a new deck. Yeah. Uh, it has a DSer and uh, you might like it. You mm. might like it. And a vinyl emulator. And a vinyl emulator. I'm gonna get my adapter. You you, you talk to um, our lovely viewers. Yeah. There's a phone ringing. Yeah. We have a, f a caller. <laughs> yeah. So uh, maybe uh, we, d we do take requests. Uh, well, what we did, we, um, we, we have two new stuff for you, actually. Uh, the first new uh, thing is that we have tweaked and uh, uh, worked on the microphone setup of this streaming, uh, uh, streaming broadcast. Um, what we have tried to do is to share with you the sonic uh, quality of uh, you know what's coming out of the uh, electronics so uh, we put uh, two um, condenser microphones uh, just maybe one and a half meters uh, from the speakers and uh, based upon your re reactions it was already uh, very uh, much better ameliorated in, in comparison to what we did earlier uh so we have uh two mics maybe the viewers can yeah yeah you, you can see it you can see them we have yeah two mics uh, in uh, ortf yeah position yeah uh let's say they're just maybe half a meter from the audio rack yeah and uh the result is that you have a quite immersive uh sound when you put on headphones or you play this stream on your speakers should be yeah and then we have these two uh thingies these two big microphones they're all wired of course it's because we had troubles with microphone. the wireless uh setup there it's all wired and we have two vocal microphones sitting one meter in front of uh, our position we should be more apart the viewers say <laughs> No, nah, we're okay. We have a cross talk cancellation board uh, um, uh, in between us. And Frank asks, and it's a good one, why not take the analog audio signal from the deck directly? Um, I don't think you can get the imaging results we get now, but uh, for future uh, uh, references, we do it this way. Um, I think it's a good idea and we'll definitely try it to see or hear if there are any differences if we put the uh, uh, cables directly in the deck. Could be possible. What cables? The microphone cables. Huh. Use them uh, as a line source transmitter to the audio. <laughs> you can try. Wait a minute. So you just put the microphones into, let's say, the 501 as analog yeah. input? Yeah. And then? No, no, no. The, the, the microphone cables directly in the deck. Yes. Yeah. Then you can hear differences as well. Yeah. I think this... Um, yeah, let me think. Yeah, we can, we can try. We, we, we could. Yeah. Okay. Interesting idea. Thanks. Well, 
I th uh, re re relate says imaging results from the deck are impossible. That's only for the speakers. Our uh, experience is different. Uh, when we, uh, you will hear what the uh, results can be. Yeah. Uh, speakers, of course, have a bigger impact on imaging overall. That's for sure. Decks do something with imaging. We'll go from the Pavan uh, to the Morphise, and then you'll hear the differences, I well, guess. Let's, l let's first talk about the wax yeah. and then the setup, because people don't know what Pavan and Morphise is. That is yeah. okay. in, in this um, emission, this All right. broadcast. Uh, I'll switch uh, sources on this software. And yeah, Mike, uh, uh, Jaap is having uh, problems every time with uh, with static. Yeah, <laughs> I'm I'm, w I'm wearing leather shoes he's already. He's loaded. <laughs> I'm I'm loaded. Uh, can you see me now? Yes, we can see you now. Okay. Um, let's talk about the system. This is the Wise Deck 501. Uh, it's pretty new. Um, it's a streamer deck preamp. Uh, DSP device all in one headphone amp even um, as you can see here you can touch the screen it's a touch screen and then set some stuff um, in the DSP there are room EQ possibilities you can, do, you can use a DSer uh, vinyl emulation yeah there's a vinyl emulator uh, inside uh, so Equal it's a very equalization very yeah, e EQ. Can you hear me as well? Yeah, e and this one uh, as well. Well, actually, Wise, as peop some of you will know, studio brand, yeah, famous in digitizing in the first stage of of uh, a CD, uh, and Wise has actually implemented some studio features uh, in this deck. So yeah. uh, there is a famous deesser. Uh, yeah, it's also at uh, several that. studios in Visual Arts, for example, the Essers is white uh, apparatus, yeah. 19 inch, and uh, he implemented some of some of these uh, functions, which uh, are also actually available as software plugins. Yeah, uh, in this deck 501, which is I think uh, the only brand who does this. I, I I don't know any other brands that implement features like this no, it's uh, and, and we will try it of course during this test and see what it does so this is a very versatile device it's around 8000 euros it's expensive but if you consider the fact that it's a streamer rune endpoint deck preamp uh, and dsp uh, i think you get a pretty good deal and it's also available in large size yeah the 502 is larger and has a balanced headphone output at the back uh, but apart from that, there's no difference. Um, no. So beneath that is the Morphise from Sonnet Audio. Uh, Sonnet Audio is created by Kees Ruitenberg. Um, we use the Metrum Acoustics Pavan for a long time now. Uh, it's also de developed by him. Uh, the Sonnet is different in that way that the deck modules uh, have now four decks and not two. So every module inside, and there are four of them, uh, have four decks, so that's 16 in total. The big difference between these is that this is a normal Delta Sigma deck, and this is a NOS deck, non-oversampling deck, so it has no filters. Um, this is only a deck preamp. Uh, this is more. This is also a streamer, like we told. Uh, the Metro Acoustics Pavan is only a DAC. Uh, this was the <coughs> premium model from Metrum Acoustics. This is the succeeder of the uh, Jade, Jade, Jade. Jade DAC. 3,500 euros, five, around 5,000 euros. With both, you need a streamer. So we use the Metrum Acoustics Ambre uh, for, as a source. Yeah. And Room both bridge. have the I2S yeah. module, so we can stream uh, with I2S out. With the Pavan, you even need a preamp, and we need the Passlabs XP12. So this is a pretty expensive stack. Uh, it's How much is it? Um, so actually, with the <laughs> XP, the Pavan, yeah, it's and the bridge, you have the same. <laughs> this is 
ten. Seven seven thousand two hundred euros. Uh, that that's only the entry level model from Pass Labs. So it's the loser. You have to model. start somewhere. You have to start <laughs> somewhere. Uh, seventy two hundred euros. Five. So that's twelve. Twelve. And a little bit. Then and about twelve fifty. So yeah. uh, uh, thirteen and a half, and you need some cables. Yeah. So that's fifteen thousand. This is eight. So that's half. It's pretty funny <laughs> if you think about it. This is thirty five hundred with. 1250 yeah. and some cables so that's around five but no preamp is uh, either you will oh yeah this is a preamp uh, preamp phone control yeah. Us. yeah 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 but this has no analog inputs this has no analog inputs yeah. uh, this of course does so that's the stack uh, we use cables from uh, gym audio the tpm the reason is that it's the most neutral cable i know uh, maybe on YouTube now, there are some people that say, no, I know some other cables. There, I'm sure there are other cables that are very neutral, but we use Grim Audio TPM. Um, not the SQM. I think the SQM is more bassy than the TPM. Yeah. Uh, it's newer, but I don't think it's better. Um, no. We listened to it for a long time and Eventually, I thought, yeah, the TPM is more neutral than the SQM. I use the TPR because it's it's price. cheap and it's very good. <laughs> it's very good. Um, power cables are from AudioQuest Energy 1000. Um, we use stock cables now, but we are going to change the power cables because in this level of performance, you actually hear a big difference yeah. in power cabling. Maybe we can let them hear it as well. Yeah, let's let, let's try. Yeah, let's we'll try. try. So, that's so the yeah. stack. Uh, let's see. Yes, any questions on this? Uh, let's see. I'm gonna change the camera. All right. Um, yeah. Any questions? Can uh, it subscribe to the link in the Oh, yeah, can. Frank, we hebben allerlei configuraties. Uh, ik hou het even op dit, denk ik. Dat is wat handiger nu. Um, Oké. Okay. The question was if we could uh, move the some screens and. Uh Relit says the XP12 is much better than the XP10. Yes, I totally agree. It's <laughs> a big difference. Uh, also price-wise. Price-wise, it was also a big difference. <laughs> I had an XP2.5. Then we went to the XP10, that's a big step. And the XP10 to the XP12 is also a very big step in performance. Yes. It's it's a lot better. We are very fond of air, of pass labs, but you know... Uh, uh, Goedemorgen, Fernand, je bent er ook bij. Quite pricey. <laughs> the power amp, oh yeah. Uh, the power amp is a Bryston 4B SST3, and we use Focal Sopra speakers. Uh, speaker cabling is AudioQuest Oak. And uh, we use an Isotech uh, Titan Evo 3 for filtering the power amp. Yeah. Uh, and it works like a charm. And for the all the sources, we use a Kemp uh, power, power strip, strip 8 Plus, if I remember correctly. Still hanging on there for years. Sti yeah, sti wow. Eight years yeah. now yes. we use that. Networking optical. Yeah, network uh, link is optical. And then my knowledge tops on networking, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, Relut has a Nagra preamp. Yeah, must be amazing. Um, which one do you have? Wi which Nagra, yeah. Okay, let's play some music. Where yes. do we start? We start uh, with the wise? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Ma and, so. and the last time also we had some viewers who had some nice suggestions on what to listen to. So maybe uh, we could do that again. Yeah, you can uh, say, uh, you can suggest some songs. Uh, we go to, le okay. let's start off with that drum song you used. Uh, yeah, with Little Fugue. Yeah. But I have to get connected to Alpha Media again. Yeah. Jung does the music, so if you have any suggestions... Uh, I'm the DJ today. He's the DJ. No sanctuary here. 
Again, no? It, it can no, if you put the... F Stop the senses the boss wanna know what's going on so joseph and mary hit the road with mary and i home nine months gone and you know we're talking about a hell of a walk and they had no place to stay they tried the inns and the hotels the message was plain as day you get no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here. One had his one need up, and a baby boy they named Miguel. On the other side of the line, it's heaven. On this side, it's a living hell. So you do what it takes, pick up stakes. And try to escape the drought. But when you get to the border of the INS, they got the welcome wagon out. You get no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. Religion to preach about loving your brother, but they run by the bowling green. Now there's a lot of folks are looking over the edge of that plate we piled so high. When they all decide to come over the border, time to kiss it all goodbye. There'll be no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, and no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, no respite. And no sanctuary here, no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. Well, you guys heard it's not actually streaming from the deck, it's streaming from the microphones. Yes. Um, well, I'm, I'm really glad to hear that it sounds so great yeah. uh, because this is a pilot run for us in this setup. This is the first time we used this setup. Of course, we tested some stuff to know it's, uh, it's actually working. Um, but yeah, we're really glad to hear that it sounds good at your place as well. Uh, I hope it's um, uh, uh, well. What what songs do you want to hear? Jung is uh, our DJ today. Oh, you got the the drum song. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, we're gonna do a next song, and after that, we want I want to switch to the sonnet to see what yeah. it does. All right. Jacques Lussier, Bach, Little Fugue in G minor.
All right. We have um, an own recording uh, with an artist that's our neighbor, Tim Knoll. He is a guitarist and a singer. Uh, we recorded this with the same microphones in this room. So it's quite a good reference. Actually, it's on the spot where the microphones are at yeah. the moment. So, so we, we uh, recorded it right here in front of us. Uh, it's not mastered. It's not compressed. Uh, it's just as is. As is. Yeah, with the same microphones you are listening to now. Uh, well. Test. Yeah, some say it's, it's very soft. Um, that's true. Yeah, it's... Yeah. You mean in terms of sound volume? Yeah, and I think in sound timbre. Well, it's, you know, uh, it's a guitar solo, unmastered take. Yeah. Um, Straight in. The What we just talked about, it, it, the, what strikes me in this recording is that you can hear the closeness of you know the intimacy of the recording yeah uh, it's pretty difficult to make a single guitar recording not bigger than life yeah uh, because that's what actually recordings sometimes can do uh, especially played on on a system like this that the guitar is suddenly yeah. three meters apart and actually can you can hear the intimacy of and uh, we were there, Jaap. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Of uh, what's wha what Tim did in this room. Um, and that's quite something. I think it, it re represented exactly what we were listening yeah. to in this room. It's it's the same. And that's, that's uh, pretty powerful. Um, so that's actually, you know, what a studio... Um, it's a studio apparatus, of course, right? So uh, in the studio, you'll, uh, and it's used... Uh, not s uh, it's more used for mastering purposes so it's yeah. two uh, uh, most of channel Weiss's products are two channel AD and uh, DA uh, 
and also the effects uh, compressors and DSers and they're used True. in mastering studio yeah and there you have to uh, you know what comes in goes out yeah and you have to uh, be able to assess the effects of what you're doing as a mastering engineer um, yeah uh, shall we take one reference song on the wise and then switch to the sonnet yeah yeah but we also already had three you want one more yeah one more okay. just to as a reference then do we, we can do switch we have some suggestions that people say rock yes yeah. it is very some said rock no, and it's roll still in the morning i'm 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 not a real rock and roll fan to be honest well we can we can uh, uh, suggestions metallica <laughs> metallica yeah uh rush tom sawyer rush what's that tom sawyer Rush, Tom Sawyer. Yeah. Tom Sawyer. S A S A V Y E R. Tom Sawyer. Oh, Ru Rush from Tom Sawyer, waarschijnlijk. Tom Sawyer by Rush. I guess. From the mo moving pictures. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oké, okay. let's see what it does. Not the title. Come on. Oh yeah. Uh, okay. Let's see. Uh, Why is that? Some some songs are uh, blocked. I think everything is blocked here. Yeah. Well, it's just it, these are strange times. <laughs> Sorry, we cannot play it from title, so we try to. Uh, Tom Sawyer, artist. Uh, Maybe in the meantime we can play Stephen Wilson. Yeah, uh, let's try. A little bit to know more. No, no, no. Beat. Let's go down. Let's go down and that one. No, that one. Hand cannot erase. Or the Raven, the first one. Yeah. Luminol. Luminol. Ah, yeah. Well, all right. Yeah, I, I always pick the Watchmaker. Yeah, but that that one is quiet. Yeah. True. Okay. okay. Luminol. Energy. Energy. Oh, 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 you, you had it already on 20.
Max Van Panache and tips his hat. He has no truck with idle chat. Scratched LPs Stops in with flow to sip his tea Well, um, we had some complaints about the sound. Yeah, I don't know what it was. Maybe the preamp went haywire. Um, it's 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 weird. But we're gonna change to Is the. Is it better now? I hope it's better now. Um, track you played, the audio sounded like a microphone recording. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's let's go to the first track we played. And 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 check that, and then we go to the sonnet. So the first track was yeah. That yeah, was you can go to the queue. Yeah, yeah. And on M on above. Uh, no sanctuary. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't know if it works from. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's check that. Senses. The boss wanna know what's going on. So Joseph and Mary hit the road with Mary and I home nine months gone. And you know we're talking about a hell of a walk. And they had no place to stay. They tried the inns and the hotels. The message was plain as day. You get no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge. No respite and no sanctuary here. One had his one need up and a baby boy they named Miguel. On the other side of the line it's heaven, on this side it's a living hell. So you do what it takes, pick up stakes. And try to escape the drought. But when you get to the border of the INS, they got the welcome wagon out. You get no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. Religion they preach about loving your brother, but they run by the bowling green. Now there's a lot of folks are looking over the edge of that plate we piled so high. When they all decide to come over the border, time. 
Time to kiss it all goodbye There'll be no refuge, no respite And no sanctuary here No refuge, and no respite And no sanctuary here No refuge, no respite And no sanctuary here No refuge, no respite And no sanctuary here Okay, all sound, right. Sound all right. Let's. Yeah, it was good. Now, let's switch to the sonnet. Yeah. And thanks for the feedback because it's you know we don't know how it stands at home with you guys. No, we don't. Yeah, so we're gonna switch. Uh, we yeah, have we have to go to the Ambre now because the Wise has an internal streamer and uh, of uh, uh, referentie. Yeah, and now let's same right, same track. Yeah, no sanctuary. <laughs> I hope it's not too loud. Yep, all right. Whoa, that's different. Jesus. It's the same. So it's equally loud. Seize a call for senses. The bowels want to know what's going on. So Joseph and Mary hit the road. With Mary and I home nine months gone And you know we're talking about a hell of a walk And they had no place to stay They tried the inns and the hotels The message was plain as day You get no refuge, no respite And no sanctuary here No refuge, no respite And no sanctuary here Juanita and a baby boy they named Miguel on the other side of the line it's heaven on this side it's a living hell so you do what it takes pick up stakes and try to escape the drought but when you get to the boat of the island there's they got the welcome wagon out you get no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here Between religion to preach about loving your brother, but they run by the bowling green. Now there's a lot of folks are looking over the edge of that plate we piled so high. When they all decide to come over the border, time to kiss it all goodbye. There'll be no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, and no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge. 
no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No sanctuary Okay, all decks are the same. All, all DA converters are the same, of it's course. Digital and image, uh, is imaging is also the same. Uh, sorry, uh, yes, yes. Yeah, it's all the same. Uh, <laughs> wow, that's a big difference. Yeah. It's uh, the Weiss is much more studio focused than the Sonnet. I think the Sonnet is more hi fi. Yeah. I thought it was very neutral. But actually, it's pretty warm. You <laughs> yeah. uh, thought that you know the uh, Sonnet was a quite neutral performing deck. Well, Relit is actually right. Uh, he says it feels like the Sonnet is more forward. Yeah, it is. It is. It is more forward, and the Wise is much more laid back, also in imaging. Yeah. And the thing is, if uh, you, uh, you, the we re reviewed uh, my deck two from Wise, yeah, which is also very much more forward. You know, it surrounds you definitely. With -wise. Di this one is much more laid back yeah. and more precise because, especially much with Tim precise. Knoll, because we knew the recording, it really was so precise. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is much more. Yeah, make it a little big, make it big yeah. uh, and, and, and tasty, like a little dot of cream. Yeah, it and here, and you know, at the white, you can hear the differences in the, the room where it was recorded, either live or studio. Maybe even the. They want to hear the wise again. I think it's good. Let, let's go back to the same track, pick 30 seconds as a reference. Yeah, okay. yeah. You can, you can do it quickly. Yeah, I can. He's so quick. Then I, I'll yeah, let's go. Let's go back to the wise, and after that, let's go to the Pavan. The boss wanna know what's going on. So Joseph and Mary hit the road with Mary nigh home nine months gone. And you know we're talking about a hell of a walk. And they had no place to stay. They tried the inns and the hotels. The message was plain as day. You get no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, no respite. And no sanctuary here. Yeah. One had his one need up, and a baby boy they named Miguel. On the other side of the line, it's heaven. On this side, it's a living hell. So you do what it takes, pick up stakes. And try to escape the drought. But when you get to the bowl of the INS, they got the welcome wagon out. You get no refuge, no respite, and no sanction. So now we're doing. Well, yeah, 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 we're online. Uh, we're gonna switch to the Pavan with the Ambre and the Pass. So that's the big setup. Uh, we're gonna change. Okay, I'm gonna swap it out. It takes yeah. a while. Yeah, no, it's okay. I'll. Uh, so actually, what we're doing now is um, to make it more comparable. Uh, we're having three devices <laughs> doing the same as what the wise is supposed to do. So uh, we have uh, the past labs preamp. 
we have the Pavan deck, and we have the Ambra Metrum, both from Metrum Ambra uh, Rune Bridge. Yeah. Okay. Is it ready done? Uh, yeah. So let's take the same track, right? Yeah. Uh, so yeah, for it should be around the same volume. Okay, I think volume wise it's the same, we're always around 75. Have I ever Yeah, gewoon spelen. Yeah, I speel. Oh, uh, maybe sources. Oh, uh, no, no, no. I think that minus square s is out. Yeah, één kabel los. Geen haast, ja. No hurries, no worries. Huh? Ah. Oh, yeah. Misschien moet ik even de kabel wisselen. Trek je hem op het begin weer? Yo. Hij draait nu. Ja, ik krijg hem. <laughs> Shit. Je zou iets moeten horen. I was trying to plug in the I2S. Can it be hot swapped? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, here. You want it here? senses the boss wanna know what's going on so joseph and mary hit the road with mary and i home nine months gone and you know we're talking about a hell of a walk and they had no place to stay they tried the inns and the hotels the message was plain as day you get no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here one had his one leader and a baby boy they named miguel on the other side of the line it's heaven on this side is a living hell so you do what it takes pick up stakes and try to escape the drought but when you get to the bowl of the INS they got the welcome wagon out you get no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here no refuge no respite and no sanctuary here Religion to preach about loving your brother, but they run by the bowling green. Now there's a lot of folks are looking over the edge of that plate we piled so high. When they all decide to come over the border, time to kiss it all goodbye. There'll be no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, and no respite, and no sanctuary here. No refuge, no respite. And no sanctuary here, no refuge, no respite, and no sanctuary here.
think it's remarkable yeah. how they can hear the staging because yeah. it is the biggest in terms of staging yeah also the biggest in terms of you know it's it's for us it's the stage it's right here it's very in our face um in my opinion yeah well they say I, I feel like i'm being tested well no we're not testing you we're just figuring out what you can hear actually on the other side because for us this is completely new this way of testing i think has never been done with actual viewers participating in the test no um we did feel the same it's yeah. the biggest in terms of staging uh, but in terms of energy in the mid-range i thought it was even bigger than the sonnet yeah and it pushed a little bit yeah, yeah. for now i like the voice the most yeah i've never would have thought that i would uh, connect listening fatigue to metron but uh, compared to wise <laughs> uh you know uh it's very it's so much more upfront you know yeah. it it, re it really adds something to the sound which is nice which is w you know, let's call it hi-fi or uh it it gets you involved yeah. in the music it does. uh this is very high quality uh it, it sounds excellent and we got used to it i like the sound of metrum uh, i like the sound of the sonnet morpheus it's the same design so and the same designer so i like the sound but i actually when i started this test i didn't know what would happen and i didn't think i would like the voice this much yeah because that's <laughs> you know i think at first sight the voice is very very neutral yeah it mm. really is but at the same time it it's involving so mm -hmm. uh, i don't know it's uh it does something with you with me yeah, yeah. you know you discover uh, new aspects new details in in tracks you are know you, we know very well yeah you had it yesterday i recall you you, you say oh yeah that I you heard something in stephen wilson i don't know what i'm you gonna think. grab that song because it's it's uh it's a different song than we normally use we normally use pariah live because it's 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 very uh, detailed it's uh, the live recordings uh are very useful for testing yeah. equipment um but this song, <laughs> uh, Perfect Life, no routine. From Hans Can I Race. Yeah, but I'm gonna pick Perfect Life because it has a vocal part in the in the s in the beginning, and I really like how it's you recorded. Have I think you have still a wise one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the wise. I can put it here if you want. No, it's okay. Uh, I'll switch. Uh, there we go. Let Let's grab this one. Um, and. I'm I'm curious. After that, we're gonna switch to the Weiss. I'm curious how the Weiss does this. Yeah. Uh, let's switch the mics. There we go. Uh, we're gonna switch this off.
For a few months, everything about our lives was perfect. It was only us. We were inseparable. But, gradually, she passed into another distant part of my memory. Until I could no longer remember her face. Her voice, even her name. We All right, we're gonna switch to the voice because I'm curious how the voice positions all the electronic effects. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, deze. En de microfoon staat ook nog goed. Oh, ik heb hem al. sister for six months. She arrived one February morning, pale and shell-shocked, from past lives I could not imagine. She was three years older than me, but in no time we became friends. We'd listen to her mixtapes, dead can dance, felt mortal coil. She introduced me to her favorite books, gave me clothes, and my first cigarette. Sometimes we would head down to Blackbird's Moor to watch the barges on Grand Union in the twilight. Everything about our lives was perfect. It was only us. We were inseparable. But gradually, she passed into another distant part of my memory. Until I could no longer remember her face. Her voice. Even her name. We've got. We've got. Uh, wow. Yeah, it's very. It's like a surgical deck, almost surgical. Let's go to the Morpheus. I'm really curious how this one. Well, you know, I was able to. Uh, more, much more able to uh, understand what what the singer was saying, the text, the lyrics. Yeah. Because in the um, with oh, yeah. All right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> right. I thought the text was more. I could I could understand more what she was saying because in the, in the first sample in the metrum the v the spoken voice and the uh, the rhythm all the these mid-range soundscapes were 
together and it, it was as if the wise was able to to relayer all the all these elements of the track mu much more than uh, uh, the metrum combination and yeah the metrum was more involving and maybe it revealed more detail yeah 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 so it's not a ma matter of b better or worse it's it, it's different yeah it is uh, I can agree, I, I can imagine that people like the past slaps Pavan setup in some songs because it's bigger. Um, but the voice is more accurate. Um, I, I'm curious what the more voice does. Yeah, so you have to go to the Ambre now, and uh, I'll start the the other microphones. Uh, let's check that one out. Okay, 
Um, well, we had a lot of comments, and uh, the funny thing is, uh, uh, people prefer different decks. Well, that's that's, that's okay. Okay, yeah. of course, there is no good or bad or uh, uh, anything because it's a matter of taste. Uh, the wise, I think, is the most neutral and the most honest deck of the three. The most revealing. Uh, and the most revealing, yes, but it's not really immersive in a way that it not takes in the you. setting because n n uh, we have not tried it. The final, uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, there are a lot the of filters. EQ, the room EQ, there are so many, much more, but this is the default setting, yeah, and just you know, it's as is. And uh, maybe we cannot ask case, but uh, uh, maybe he, he did some. I don't know some DSP or tuning case. I don't think so. No, I don't think so. I think he just built a deck uh, with certain components that create this sound. Uh, and we're comparing Nos versus uh, Delta Sigma, I think. Yeah. Uh, but the Wise could also be a custom FPGA solution, I think. Yeah, he doesn't say because of all the filtering stuff. Yeah, he doesn't really say so anything about that, but um, the sonnet is more detailed than the Pavan. Yeah. But the stereo imaging of the Pavan with the pulse laps is bigger. Yeah. So it's all a matter of taste. Yeah. Uh, but then we go to price. <laughs> Pavan with pass laps and yeah. Ambre is more than 13,000 euros, and then you still have to buy some cables. Uh, Morpheus is 3,500, and with the streamer, I think it gets up to five maximum. The Wise is an all in one solution, but it's 8,000 euros. Yeah, so that's a, that's a hard pill to swallow, I think. And I think price wise, the Wise is really, really good. Uh, Pavan with Pulse Labs and Ambre is a pretty bad deal now. <laughs> yeah. But it's what it is. You know, yeah, and, and you know, it's a matter of taste. And we're glad you guys are able, and girls are able to hear it, because uh, the differences are subtle, but there are really, really differences. And, uh, yeah, but they hear it as well. Uh, shall we do one more track comparing yeah, and the I'm three? I'm very curious on uh, 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 on playing with all these extra add-ons on this wise, aren't you? Yeah, we can try some filters uh, as a uh, as we go rounding it off. Yeah. Um, did, did we play a little fugue already on the more fast? No, not yet. Yeah.
Well, this was very nice, <laughs> actually very uh, precise. Um, in this track, the, there's, you know, the double bass is, it's all very close mic'd. Uh, the recording was very close mic'd, I think. Yeah. You can hear that? I guess. We have a double bass, which is really in the low end, so uh, it challenges the deck in terms of, you know, uh, low end reproduction and also the cymbals. Uh, and uh, the, the, you have the floor tom, which is uh, which you can which you can hear on the right if if it's if it's right with you. Um, yeah, it was. I, I think liked it, it sounded very good. It. Yeah, I like this one. And on now the we have sonata. the same track on the Metro. Pavan. Okay, well. <laughs> well, this was an interesting one. Um, yeah, well, I, we, we read it here as well. The bass is completely amazing in this combination. Yeah. The drive and the energy in, in the bass is a lot better with the pass laps, actually. Yeah. Well, we saw that earlier, the pass laps is a very, very good preamp. Very, very good. musical, very, uh, at the same time, neutral, you know, it. Uh, yeah. It has control, so we were just pondering on you know we could uh, attach the wires on the pass laps and see what it does. Yeah, we're gonna do the pass the the wires now with this track. I think it's interesting. But on the pass, right? No, 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 just direct, and then okay. we go through the pass. Yeah. See what happens. Because this this was really really good. I like this. But this was on this track, I think, when we play Stephen Wilson Perfect Life. Yeah, it was. We, we we have different maybe a different preference or so. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. All right. How oh. are you guys doing? You doing good? Oh. oh. <laughs> well, Jaap is electrified. So we're doing a 
of you again. Yeah, on the wise. Okay, volume has to be the same. Min 20, no more, no more. Wow. Yo, this is all hot for you. I'm going to wait a minute, I'm going to try again. I have the microphone so not good. Now on the pass, right? This has a certain <laughs> wow factor as well. Yes, you know, it's not, it's all good. Yeah. And, uh, we've enjoyed the track on the Metrum combination as much as on this one, but this is has a different feel. Uh, well, it, it, for me, it's actually perfectly clear, <laughs> honestly. Price-wise, the Pavan with the Pass and the Amber doesn't make any sense. It's absolutely far too expensive for now. Back then, it was a very good deal. And if you need an analog preamp, you need something like this. Yeah. And the Pass Labs is a good deal because it's a very beautiful preamp, as we heard a couple of minutes ago. But if you look at an all-in-one solution ultra high quality versatility the wise is a very good deal yeah because this is just amazingly good yes it's more accurate than the pass i think yeah and we're going to try it because we're now hooking up uh, wise yeah. on pass yep yeah, yep yep also with grim tpm But when you want uh, analog, you can buy the Bryston. Uh, sorry, the Moon. 
<laughs> then you have your uh, you have your power. 700 app. I, yeah. <laughs> we just received uh, it's playing. You can see it in the back. No, no, yeah, you can see it. Yeah, you, you can see some lights, see some red lights. The red light district is yeah back there. Okay, it's flagship open. moon it's integrated app. Okay, put it on again. Yeah, should work. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Uh. Go. Yep. Played by French late pianist, he died last year, I think. Jacques Lequier, who specialized only, a, uh, he specializes in uh, uh, new renditions of Bach, but also Debussy uh, well. Uh, uh, and he did it with his uh, his oh. jazz trio, uh, jazz trio. Um, I think well, they're also famous French musicians, Pierre Michelot on bass, André Apinet. Uh, and what they're doing is this, you know, uh, they're uh, making their interpretations of classical pieces and uh, particularly uh, Bach. And uh, he also does Brandenburg uh, concertos in Czechos in, in Czechoslovakia, so it's pretty long. Uh, and um, especially there in the 90s, the recordings were amazing, really amazing. I have the CDs, and uh, we almost blew up some speakers uh, while playing it. Uh, I don't know what you thought of it, but uh, this was quite uh, astonishing what the Fast Lab does with uh, with sound. Uh, it adds some musicality. It adds some uh, profoundness in bass response. 
And what I found it was that it was less responsive, less well in the mix. It's more upfront, less analytical, less you know revealing. But it was very musical, very involving, um, very nice to look at. Maybe you could see it in a body shot. That's how it's really not very easy to really see at home. Um, so well, we uh, we were we we couldn't really say which one was more um, preferred, you know, the fast lap or the wide stand alone, all in one combination. We have some company to do. Yeah, I thought it was one o'clock, but uh, it's it's no problem. You can introduce yourself to our viewers if you like. <laughs> But um, we were rounding it off anyway. Uh, I didn't get what you told. No, I, I want to try with one or two uh, um, the vinyl. Because also online. Oh, yeah, the filters. Ado about the filters that Wise uses. Yeah. Uh, so I suggest maybe you, you put on a filter. You know how, to, how it works. I, I can <laughs> definitely do that. So, what Wise has. He has Yes, some DSP stuff uh, filters on it. DSP vinyl emulation enabled. Okay. And saturation, we can put it on uh, uh, two dBs. Yes. Yeah. So. Okay. Um, let's go. Okay. What are we listening to? What what shall we do? Yeah. Well, let's. Shall we do? Uh, we can make a bit of sound. Maybe. Yeah, the little fusion and all that. The status bar. Uh, oh, so I'm curious if we hear hear vinyl pitch or something. Yep. I don't know. <laughs> Go. It's more spacious. sister for six months. She arrived one February morning, pale and shell-shocked, from past lives I could not imagine. She was three years older than me, but in no time we became friends. We'd listen to her mixtapes, Ted can dance, felt mortal coil. She introduced me to her favourite books, gave me clothes, and my first cigarette. Sometimes, we would head down to Blackbird's Moor to watch the barges on Grand Union in the twilight. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I don't know if you heard it, but um, definitely softer. Yeah. The, uh, with vinyl, uh, it becomes more spacious, more warm, softer. Uh, usually on vinyl, they uh, um, everything below 100 hertz is mono, so you get a more tight bass response. Uh, and what we're now going to do is to um, uh, we're going to uh, uh, plug in the deesser. Do you want it surgical or smooth? 
Let's try surgical first. Surgical. And we do it with the same track because this yeah. lady has yeah, uh, an, a nice S -y S because 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 the S is very m prevalent in yeah. English. Microfoontje aan. Um, ja. Um. Well. <laughs> Relit asks why does the 502 have a white uh, chassis? Um, I don't know actually. It's, it's, it's the same device. I think it's available in both colors or not? Yeah, know. black and white. Uh, I think it's it's just because of form factor. Yeah, why all wise equipment pro and high end are white because wise white, you know. Yeah, wh wide, wide. The white, the white and the wise. Yeah. Uh, I think it's just for aesthetics. Aesthetics. Um, some people want a big chassis, other one want a small chassis. Oh, white. Yes. Uh, it's the same device, but the bigger version has a balanced headphone output, and that's it. Actually, we haven't tested headphone output yet. But no, we but will. we will in the review. This was just for you to compare some products and you can hear what happens. Um, we're gonna round off, uh, finish it off. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think you could hear what every device uh, can do and can't do. I think um, I didn't, um, yeah, how do you say it? I think it's pretty hard. The Weiss is the most versatile device, but 8,000 euros is a lot of money. Yeah. The Sonnet Morpheus is a lot cheaper, even with the Metro Acoustics Ambre. Um, but sound-wise, I think the Weiss is better. Sounds wise. Yeah, it sounds wise. Yes, it's it's more and uh, more transparent, uh, more detailed. Uh, yeah. Uh, I found that it was m even more an involving yeah. when other decks were, you know, more upfront and more doing their best to impress us. Yeah. But I thought, you know, with the wise, you could really hear anything. You hear everything. You hear Stamps new like a rock. music. You see, you hear new layers that were yeah. unrevealed before. Yeah. Uh, True. Um, and the pass laps with the Pavan doesn't make any sense. But in the uh, in the bassy track, the rhythmic track yeah. was very impressive. You know, if you uh, you don't need the Pavan, I thought the the pass laps with the wise, but if you have the money, yeah, 
Why, why not? The voice you know? with the pass laps is the best, but it's really, really, really expensive. And then you have one of the best brands in digital and one of the best brands in, in analog in amp amplification. Yeah, true. So uh, yeah, it does make sense, and it's you could really hear that uh, you know the added value of connecting these two. Yeah. Uh, super brands. I thought the pass laps uh, did color a lot before, well, a lot for high end. Yeah terms it, it I thought it was pretty warm but mm -hmm. with the Weiss it was still very tight yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. so uh, that's good but thank you for watching yeah uh, I hope this was uh, a nice live stream which you could also hear the sound was better than the last time um, I, I hope you liked it leave some comments uh, also on alphaaudio.nl or yeah, we'll alpha we'll save Audio. this one on our own website because it yeah. will be uh, Put off, uh, put yeah. offline. Uh, YouTube doesn't seconds allow. Seconds after we uh, we stop this recording. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So if you want to replay it, uh, visit alphaaudio.net for the English, uh, and uh, alphaaudio.nl for Dutch speaking. Yeah. Thank you for watching, and see you next time. Yep. Yeah. Bye, bye bye. Okay. Stop.